Big Herc 916 getting down with Bigo. Yeah, man, then jumped on Bigo and I'm doing my thing over there so you could check me out. The link is in the description. Um, you know, it's uncensored. I don't have to deal with all the red tape and uh, worried about um, getting um, <laughs> unmonetized uh, or things of that nature because of the topics I'm talking about. I could be freely conversational, enjoy chit chat with different people. I'll be organizing live streams over there. I'll also be doing um, organized uh, uh, panels. So check me out on Bigo, Big Herc 916. Would love to see you. And, um, you know, it's all about that positivity and that motivation. What up? Big Herc 916. Positivity, motivation. I'm out here in Scottsdale at the Fashion Center. About to check out this car show. So let's take a stroll through here and check out what cool whips they got on this way. NSX, Lambo. Got a Ferrari California over here. Yeah. Uh, this Huracan's pretty cool. It's got a carbon fiber hood with some green accents. Green brake calibers. This is pretty cool. It's a Curtis five five hundred. I don't think I could fit in this thing. Looks like an old British uh, race car. Ferrari, classic Jaguar. A lot of uh, exotics at this car show. A lot of Ferraris. Oh, this is a nice Ferrari. 812, super fast. It's got a really clean, uh, it's gonna look like it's almost got a, like a wrap on it, but it's not a wrap. Size of these brakes, these brakes are pretty massive, these ceramics. Oh, it really makes the Ferraris his interior. The interior in these cars are just exquisite. And then you have performance at its highest level. Got a Ford GT, looks like a, maybe a factory five replica. And this thing is sitting low. Look at the interior of this thing, it's all about the race mode. You can't even get in without taking off the steering wheel. Got the exhaust coming out the center back here. And uh, if you've seen Ford versus Ferrari, to give you an idea what kind of car you're working with. This 427 with the A stack EFI setup, man, with the bundle of snakes. Beautiful motor. That's a work of art back here. And does your lovely wife love cars? So you have all three generations of the Ford GT here. Which one would you take if you had your option? Would you take the first, second generation, or the third generation? Look at this classic Ferrari. I'm not even sure what model it is, but it's beautiful. Anything classic, man, I can have a great appreciation for. 275 GTB. Beautiful car. Saline S7. Man, this is one of my all-time favorite cars. If I could pick a supercar today to jump into, it would be the Saline S7. This car is so ahead of its time, man. Beautiful car. Lines on this car are just amazing. And they're doing nothing but going up in value. You won't lose on a car like this. 
It's a beautiful Maharati here. Very, uh, man, pristine condition. I'm not sure the model, but it's a beautiful car. Gilead. I kind of thought it was a Gilead, but I don't want to jump out there. A couple of Mercedes here. It's a 190. And uh, I want to say a, <clears throat> a 300 SL convertible. Yeah, that was right. Both the 300 and the 190 are just timeless in their design. Got Ferrari Enzo. You know you can't go wrong with this. Beautiful car. Enzo 12. Oh yeah. Look at this Lincoln right here. Whipple Supercharger, matte black. This thing is sinister. Oh man, that's badass. It's got a, it's like, so it looks like a, I want to say a Coyote SVT engine with a Whipple Supercharger. Look at this interior, man. He said this is a three year build, 900 horsepower. This thing is monsters. Got the Ken Diggit handles on it. It's got a, the centerpiece delete. Man, this thing is nice. Twenty twos. Got a couple classic Corvettes here. I never get tired of looking at those. 60, I want to say either 66 or 65. Pretty original looking. Beautiful shape though. Stingray. Got your choice of yellow or red. Now I'm not sure what this is. <clears throat> it almost looks like um, some type of kit car but I'm not sure which one it would be. It's got a sequential shifter in it. I don't see a name on it. And then it has a... No, no name on it. The back kind of looks like Ferrari, but it has a rear-mounted uh, spur engine. It's pretty interesting. It looks like it's a roaster. So this is... The uh, fashion, I guess this is the fa considered the fashion plaza or fashion center car show, you guys. Leave a comment, let me know what you think. Um, met some pretty cool people, man. Pretty well diverse crowd. Um, this is considered like the Beverly Hills of Arizona. Hello, I'm Big Herc 916 Contact me for life coaching and motivational speaking. Welcome to Vault TV. If you're fed up with paying cable companies and streaming apps too much money every month for limited content, then Vault TV is the solution you've been waiting for. Vault TV uses our innovative software to connect you with up to 17,000 live TV channels from over 50 countries worldwide. Watch up to 100,000 movies on demand, up to 5,000 TV shows with over 120,000 episodes live sports, news, and so much more. Starting as low as $12.99 per month and no need for a cable guide to come to your home, it's never been a better time to make the switch to Vault TV. Save money and have the full freedom to control your home entertainment your way. Visit us at vaulttv.com and start saving money today. What up, Big Herc 916. You know, I'm a really big car guy and I've been working with a lot of different brands doing sponsorship. Well, I recently got a sponsorship with Muscle Up Car Detail Spray. 
um, check out the link in the description um, man this spray is the bomb and it works great on cars as far as you know the, the, the paint the trimmings but it also works great on wheels look how dirty these wheels are now I just had these um, powder coated black and they're pretty dirty but I'm gonna go ahead and spray some of this non chemical based detail spray on here so you can see how well it cleans these wheels give it a nice white and I'm kind of doing it you know fairly fast so you can kind of see what's going on here but man it doesn't it doesn't streak and it's safe it's safe for your wheels because it doesn't um, have any chemicals so if you have powder coated wheels or if you have uh, um, if you have a, a, a wrap it's not gonna damage your wrap but it gets your wheels I mean man this is something you can take with you you know while you're going to car shows you just got to make sure you you use a clean microfiber rag but take a look at that I mean wow it really cleaned the wheels real well and I still would have to go inside a little bit more but just to show you it, it does a great job but it doesn't streak at all so muscle up car detail spray get you some